This is Chuck Freeman, uh, I got by King Arthur, right? And I just want to say that, uh, um, my stuff was stolen, you know. Reported that. Cops here in Cecil County ain't gonna do nothing about it. They're having themselves a laugh, a jolly while they do to all day with me. You know, uh, and you know, you get people around here and tell you stories they don't even know what they're talking about. I went out and checked on a place that, uh, Guys trying to tell me it used to be a workplace out there uh, uh, at uh, Triumph Industrial Park, Trinco. It used to be Trinco one time. Central Chemical. He said, oh, the building was tore down. Couldn't believe that too well, you know, because you get around a bunch of drug people who don't. That's, their brains are already fried with, uh, like, scrambled eggs. You'll find that's not true. Because I just went out there. The old Central Chemical building's there because the place where I used to work there is tore down, the uh, rail car place. And, but, uh, this guy, I don't want to insult, I've insulted a lot of people already, but for the truth, you know, and I know Baker, there's Judge Baker, uh, Bonnie Snyder, they're all Snyder, uh, they're all related good ones, this is the good old boy county, they call it the good old boy, come here, they got some good brotherly evil love for you, you know, they'll put you in jail, steal your property, uh, along with the federal government in Washington, D.C., they got a cl click at that, Delaware government, they got them in the good old boy businesses and stuff. They got people that uh, own businesses that, that uh, go in, auctioneers and stuff. They go in to steal your shit. Just like they did mine. Like my stuff gets burned. And, and this is no lie. So let them try and tell me, slap me for, uh, stop me for slander. Because they'll try and sue me anyway. But you know, the kid they framed me up. Now, I went on the uh, internet. Now, you can't believe everything you see written on the internet. Uh, but in the on the internet the uh in the uh this kid that they accused me of 20 uh 20 some years ago me being the father of this illegitimate kid which was not mine it was a frame up because i run my mouth but i found that he's listed uh as a uh sex offender i said whoa in delaware uh, in maryland but whoa he's supposed to be living in delaware uh, now i don't know if it's the same boy but this boy that they accused me of was in trouble with the law, supposed to be. But you know, I seen a cop around here looks a little bit like that kid. Who knows, man? They've been pulling all kinds of stupid shit. They've, they've, they've got people coming here that look like doubles. I've seen a couple lookalikes that don't look like this and look like that. But I know, uh, you know, I know like on TV with that soap opera politics, you know, remember Bill Clinton was president and that Monica Lewinsky, he, he's supposed to, uh, got a blowjob from her and he took and smoked a cigar from her pussy. <laughs> Seriously. You know something, Clinton looks like a nice guy. I mean, you look at him. A nice guy like that back in the night, and Emma Gore, Clinton, and William Jefferson Clinton supposed to be married to that, uh, uh, Rod Ham Clinton. Rod Ram, you're like, uh, Rod Ram, you know, sounds like uh, Astro the dog. Elroy, Rod Ram. Oh, I made jokes about that. But believe it or not, I believe, you know, Bill Clinton had better pussy than that. I believe he could have got better pussy than that. Come on, him being good look, a guy like him wouldn't be hanging all over him, man. Probably hanging all over his dick like a fucking grape on a vine. Or like, like, like he's a, like when I used to see a possum one time, with all these little baby possums hanging off of him. He'd have women hanging on his dick like that. Seriously. <laughs> But, you know, I think my, this Monica Lewinsky they had on TV is supposed to uh, uh, give him a blowjob stuff. You know, like, you know, government agents, have, like actors have stunt doubles, you know, do stunt work for them. Well, that Monica Lewinsky was probably, and maybe the Clinton, was actually a stunt double. Both of them were stunt doubles. They were the, they were the actors to take the heat in front of the cameras, but the real the real ones are kept secret in the background. Unknown stuntman hit, hit in the ground, hit in the background, you know. Without their uh, telling their story, they're back there getting it into hey, 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 you know, like a lead major song says, uh, I'm not the kind to do kiss and tell, but I've been seeing with Pharaoh, you know, <laughs> time uh, I go out my body, hey, 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 you know, and all that stuff, you know. <laughs> I'm the new, he says, well, Robert Redford's out there signing autographs. He says, I'm the new stuntman at, at that stunt store. See, they were probably the stuntman that did it, uh, the real ones, and these actors, like, uh, there's two out front. Because, I mean, her being fat the way she was, I mean, I'm saying so bad, but I believe Clinton, Clinton had better pussy than that. That girl was like a one to jump in front of them to take the bullet, you know, where the real girl was staying back. She's probably a better piece of pussy, you know. Hey, you know, I've had I've had my beautiful women in my time, but they they framed me up 
They, they ought to let you see on the internet the pork fat that they accused me of. Old Cynthia Lynn Snyder, pork fat. And she is, hey. Let them sue me for saying they framed me for a kid because I run my mouth on this county. And, uh, hey, we already know the president and all the government deals in drugs. Come on, man. Everybody knows it, man. Mafia organized crime, you know. Hey, Kennedys were in the 60s. They were tied with the mob. How many other people were tied with the mob? You know? But, uh, you know, uh, um, but to get back to it, you know, I was framed for a kid who wasn't mine because I run my mouth to a congressman and cost Cecil County some money. And I had an article in the paper in 1989, Drug Pusher, pusher a Hotline, a Big Joke, when the government deals drugs. And that's why they fucking start shitting on me. I've been followed. I was followed this morning by an asshole. I said enough. Nobody gives a fuck anyway, but fuck all you. Fuck you all, motherfuckers. Hey. Wait till it happens at your door and see how you cry. You'll be like Jimmy Swag. I'm going to play the cry and, and, and you know, I have sinned. <laughs> I have sinned. Hey, you know something? If Jimmy Swagger cries over two women, uh, a mother and daughter he just fucked, shit, I've had more women than that. I ain't crying over it, and I ain't sorry for it. I loved all the pussy I had. I loved them all. Hey, I had girls sit on my face. You ever had a girl sit on your face for for 35, 40 minutes, sat there without coming up. Pussy is so good, man. I mean, I must have been in hell where all the beautiful angels are, or heaven or whatever, and I got kicked the fuck out, because that's what happened to me. God either threw me out, or Satan threw me out, because he was jealous of me eating too much pussy, getting some beautiful girls. I'm just saying it right here and now. You know, hey, I'm glad I sinned. Seriously, I am glad I sinned. Hey, I'm not sorry. I'm going to hell, so what? There's a lot of people, other people going to hell for their shit. Hey, I'm not worried about it. I'm not sorry for one damn bit getting all the pussy I had. And if you look in some of those porno magazines and go look at women like that, I had women like that. They were nines or tens. You ask anybody used to hang out the down under and the college girls in Wilmington, Delaware, uh, uh, 20, 30 some years ago. Uh, like uh, 30 years ago, 20, uh, 25, 26 years ago. Here's a good song. You got to cool it now. You got to cool it now. Stay in control. You got to cool it now. <laughs> Chuck Freeman King Arthur, sign up. Fuck you. Blind Melon Chipman. Go downtown. Go see my girl. No. Go sing her a song. Go give her some ding dong. <laughs> Shit, bitch. I'm the sheep of Arabic. Your love belongs to me. <laughs> Leon Redbone. I'm like Leon Rabbon, singing a song, want a girl to suck my dome all night long. Can you know the Chuck from the side of the 